Are you loving my pandemic seek? I call this pandemic seek because it's stylish, it's fashionable. It's as a result of the pandemic that I my hair has grown so very much. So I call it pandemic chic. Also related to this pandemic quarantine, what I really wanted to tell you all about was a really, a number of sad yet, a number of sad stories with some beauty thrown in there. And let's go ahead and start with the beautiful because I I have a new pet, guys. I have a new pet. And uh, there's this moth, okay? Bear, bear, stick with me, stick with me, stay with me, okay? There's this moth that has been circulating downstairs because I, I share a house with a number of people and I live in the basement. And I do have a private bathroom though. But I... It can often get kind of lonely downstairs in the basement all by myself. And there's this moth that has flown down here. And at first I was frustrated. I was like, why is this thing here? And then, and I was like, get out, get out. And, and I remember the first day that I saw it. See, I'm about, I am such a sap. I'm about to make myself start to cry. But um, the first day I saw it, it was sort of just flying around a bunch. And I was like, oh, because I was trying to sleep when I saw it. Like it, I saw it, I guess it started getting up while I was um, doing one of those middle of the night bathroom runs, which fortunately I haven't had to do too much lately by the grace of God. Um, generally about once or twice a night. But, um, so it got up during one of those times with me and it was just flying around and I was like, oh, there's a moth in the house. What are you doing? Get out. Uh, 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 uh. But now it, I guess it knows my schedule, kind of like pets will learn your schedule. So during the day, while I'm up and about, it just picks a place and it stays there. And like, it used to be right behind the toilet and I would see it there behind the toilet and I'm like, oh, okay, cool, hey. And then it was um, right now, and it gets on different walls. But um, right now it's on the wall by the uh, basement stairs and it just sits there. And I'm like, oh my gosh, you know, I can look at this as my downstairs in the basement buddy, you know, since Puddles passed away July 3rd, 2019. And that was very hard for me, so I might not go into it too much. But, um, and I've wanted a dog, another dog, but I'm like, eh, you know, with my walking as it is currently, I'm like, I don't know if a dog would be the best choice for me. And I was like, Lately, I've been thinking, well, maybe I should get like a Chihuahua. Now, Puddles was a toy poodle, so she was tiny. Um, she really helped pull me, though. And, but yeah, so I'm like, well, maybe I can get a Chihuahua and maybe 
because sometimes people like house train their dogs or rather train their dogs to use the bathroom in the house and maybe train him to do that and then walk him or her, him or her in the mornings and yeah. But anyway, the moth is like a pet for me. And I, I let the door to the basement open sometimes so he can fly out if he wants. Because I, the other day I was like, oh my gosh, what if he or she or whatever genders, if moths even apply to gender, I guess, this construct of gender. But um, I was like, what if they, ah, there we go. What if they, the moth, want to eat something? And it's like, well, I, I guess the moth has food here um, because I'll leave that door open and the moth will just stay and not leave. So I, I'm like, well, maybe the moth wants to stay with me. You know, it's funny. I mentioned that while we were recording Verse TV. Check us out. Subscribe. Thank you all for those of you who have. Our numbers are starting to increase and we are starting to have more of an impact. So that's appreciated. Um, the guy, Anthony Cherry, and you can Google him, Anthony Cherry spelled like it sounds. The king of hair. He's also a hairstylist in Los Angeles. He also is a vocalist, musician. Vocalist and musician. Whatever, y'all understand. Because yes, a vocalist is a musician. Y'all understand what I'm saying. But um, I was talking about my pet moth, you know, and, you know, sharing my, uh, Wow, poor Aaron, poo poo poo, your pet moth. Mm -hmm. And what Anthony Cherry said to me is he was like, moths are attracted to light. And I'm like, maybe that's why it's staying with me because it feels my light, the essence. Yeah, I'm ridiculous because even talking about that's getting me a little emotional. Anyway. This video is long enough and that's gonna get me emotional too because I got the, anyway. Talk to y'all later, social media world. Stay blessed, stay safe, love. I was trying to think of a song, Love, but the only thing that came to mind was Destiny's Child's Love, which I think I do want to hear. Anyway, uh, talk to y'all later. Peace, stay blessed. Oh, I'll do the storyteller thing. We love storyteller. He's so cool. He does this. Not he does this. I saw him do it once in one of his videos. And I was like, I love it. Stay blessed.